what happened today is absolutely crazy and has not happened in any of the episodes so far. Greetings, owners of fine luxury cardboard rectangles. Welcome to the eighth installment in the Chandelier Sessions. If you're new to this, you haven't seen it from the beginning, link to the first episode in the description. At the end of the video, there'll be a playlist to the entire series. So, today is crazy, boys. Let's dive on into the world. Oh, away we go. All right, we're back for episode eight. Last time, we got the final clue for the dungeon. Now, I'm not going to actually go into that dungeon yet because I have a strategy I like to use with the dungeons because your life total carries over in the dungeon. So what I want to do is get a couple more copies of Ivory Tower so that I can try and take advantage of that to have a much better chance to get those really strong cards in the dungeon. Take a enchantment spell north. What color? Or well, whatever. I'll do it. Let me just figure out where Ferenian Tower is so I don't take on something I... Oh, is it temple or tower? Temple. All right, never mind. Any enchantments. Okay, so you're going to take something I already have. Let's go. Let's do it. Um, no, you're not offering very much. Oh, maybe I should have fought him for the uh, chance to get a white amulet. What do I want? You know what? Tell me some secrets from the green castle. Contains large green creatures. Well, that's a secret, is it? That's a secret. Oh, man. Off to the temple. Let's get us another mana link. Oh, 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 that's a powerful enchantment you took. But I'm also not playing white, so... Okay, we're at 20 life now. Pretty nice. White ammos for enchantments? No, we're going to keep the white ammos. Oh, I have two white ammos now. Nice. Defeat a paladin for any enchantment. Pass. All right. We're here. Do we have any blue amulets? We do. Let's teleport to a random... Oh, wait. No, let's go find Craig Haven. Craig Haven, I should say. To the east. And we will buy... Where's Craig's Haven? Maybe it's in this middle area here. There's no names. Let's go looking. Let's go looking. Hey, treasure. Diamond mine. Oh, but I'm, I'll lose... Oh. No, I don't want to lose my white... Nope, I'm not doing it. I don't want to lose my white gems. No, thank you. All right. All right, all right, all right. Oh, a Beastmaster for three white amulets. You, sir, have yourself a deal. Now we just got to find a Beastmaster. Come here, buddy. You're going to get it. You got you to gotta go so I can get three white amulets because that is a deal and a half, man. Every white amulet equals a town you can protect. Oh, I hate Naf's Asp. That card's so annoying. Alright. Uh, you know what? Let's just fireball it. That card's so annoying. It's got this stupid trigger that when it hits you, this trigger sticks around and does a damage to you every turn. You can pay one mana to get rid of that. So it's just, it's just an exercise in annoyance, which reminds me, I should get some of these. They're actually really solid. I should be running these. All right, well, we're looking low on mana. That's not a good feeling. Not a good feeling, but so far, we're looking okay. All right, come on. What are you doing? Nothing? Oh, good, you're land screwed as well. I'll take that. I will take that. If we're both at two lands and you don't have anything, I want them white amulets, boy. Having five white amulets makes me feel way more comfortable because the frequency with which they start to attack the towns, the different wizards, goes up as the game progresses. And they'll start to be like, bang, bang, bang. It gets really obnoxious and you start having to make difficult choices. And even though I'm having a decent run, there's no guarantee that I'm going to pull this off and win at the very end. All right. Uh, well, we can't fireball you out of the way, so let's bolt you out of the way. Since you're still mana hosed, and we'll just keep running in for some damage here. Six, 
save the giant growth for now because I only have two lands too, so we may play other creatures. I don't want to be able to giant growth to death because I can only do a one-point fireball, so my ability to control the board is severely limited right now. All right, what do we got? A jaguar hunting elves. They're fairies, so we're fine there. All right, well, let's do it, bro. Yep, I will definitely, definitely take that trade. Oh, just give me another land even, then I can drop my granite gargoyle. That's a solid flyer in this scenario. We will see where we go from there. Oh, that's, that's so frustrating. Oh, wait, wait, actually. I can swing with the Argothian Pixies and the Timberwolves, banded, and then just let the Wolves die, fireball it for one. Alright, let's do it. Come on, we need land. Come on, come on. Oh, you. All right. There we go. At least we can cast something else now. Get in there with the pixies and then we'll drop the gargoyle. Oh, what? You just, you're just going to throw away your killer bees? I'm not going to complain. I'm not going to complain for that sweet little bit of luck, boy. Alright. Come on. Alright, get out of here. Oh, you got a jaguar to kill my spider? I don't like that. But we got a giant growth to kill your jaguar if you want to block. No blocks, huh? Hmm. Do we want to just... Get, nah, you know, we'll save the giant growth. We got a flyer. We can just get in there. Another turn. Attack me. Attack me with your jaguar. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Bring it in here. Get that two points in there. Get that... What? What? Are you high? Are you very high? Computer, you so dumb. You dumb, boy. Boy, you dumb. All right. Well, if I put the giant spider out, the jaguar I'll just kill it. So that's that's kind of garbagey. All right. Well, I guess we'll just pick away at him with the granite gargoyle. We got the pixies. So if he swings, I can block him giant growth. Eat something. Or I can still just keep the giant growth for it. You know what? Screw it. I'll, all right. I'll take it, man. I'll take it. Again? You're a clown. You're a clown who deserves to lose. Okay, more. Oh, wow. All right. Perfect. That's all I needed. Double giant growth will do it. Oh, I don't have two green. What? All right. Well, whatever, I guess. Mildly disappointing. Mildly disappointing. Okay. Don't attack me. I'm <laughs> fine. Okie dokie. Stream of life it is. Alright. Oh, you've got an elf hunter too. That's so annoying. Alright, well, I guess we're just coming in with the... Coming in with the Grand Gargoyle Giant Growth. Since you like Giant Growthing it so much, we both just... We're all, only we're only casting Giant Growths on the Grand Gargoyles this game now. That's the rules for both of us, boy. You better abide them by them. Yeah, get in there with your turtle. Get your turtle in there, do a little bit of snap, and live your life. Another, a badger, huh? Alright, let's end this. Get in there, gargoyle. Oh, that's right, this is to get three white jewels, I forgot. Ugh. No, thank you. Ooh, look at this. This is a nice lineup. 
All right, let's go back to the village, get them white stones. All right, and what were we engaged in? Oh, yeah, that's right, we were exploring this territory. Nice, he just gave me two extra life in my next duel to explore this part over here, this forested area. Let's see if we can't find us some Tusk Guardians. Hey, come here, I want tribute. I want free stuff, I'm greedy. Yeah. I'll accept tribute, what do you got? What? I accepted tribute. Tribute is not a fight. I will punish you for your insolence. You will be punished! Alright, how are we looking for mana? We've got... No, we can totally afford to sacrifice this land war to get rid of the timber wolves. Oh, no trade, huh? Very well then. Oops. That was stupid. I was supposed to play the land war. You suck at magic. I sure do. All right, here we go. Scripps writes, Lanawa. And do you want to trade this turn? Is it even more enticing to you now? Nope. Okay, I'll take the free damage. All right. Fire elemental. Okie dokie. Well. You're in trouble, Lanoir. He's probably going to hunt you with that Jaguar, but if he wants to waste two mana doing that, I can live with it. I'm only going to lose one again. I can still cast either my Cockatrice or my Elven Riders. Man. Pretty thorough with your lineup there, pal. All right. Oh, those Timberwolves messed up. up. I don't like it. Do not like it. Let's... We can hunt the elves, so we'll go with the cockatrice. And we'll get out our own timber wolves. And we will attack the subscribes. If I attack with the fire elemental, we can just block with both jaguars and the timber wolves and put all the damage on one creature. And I'm not trading my fire elemental for one creature. That's a terrible deal. Ooh, yikes. That's beefy. That's beefy, boy. Alright, well... You never know when he's going to kill it or what elf he's going to target, so we may as well just get it out there and try and take advantage of it. He has no flyers, so let's get in there for some flying damage. It's pretty good. My hand's empty, but I got a lot of stuff on the board. Unfortunately, he can kill my both my land or my... Oh, wow. Thorough, buddy. Th Ooh. Ooh. Stupid timber wolves. Okay, <laughs> let's go get in there. Do we want to attack with everything else? Let's see what he does. Oh, wait, no, we can't band all these. Cause, uh, never mind, we're not doing that. We'll just go in this way. That's a mighty fine Timberwolf job there, buddy. Not going to be enough to save you, though. I'm coming for you. Should have been using your... There you go. There you go. Now you're doing it. Although you should have killed my Elven Riders. Oh, they count as Riders. That's hilarious. They don't count as Elves. Nice. I didn't even realize that. All right, so you've only got one untapped creature, so... Send in the Clowns. No, I don't want to band these guys. We're sending them all in. Get you some... And finish with the fireball. That's what you get for not giving tribute, son. Ooh, I'll take that for the flash fires. That's convenient. We're going into uh, a dungeon soon that has all white decks. So that will definitely come in handy. Lord of Fate, I do not want to duel you, bro. I want to explore. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, I'll, I'll take a second mana ball, man. That's sick. Coal golem, you say? Ugh, no, you suck. Alright. Uh, How many land overs do we have in here? Four. Okay. Mana vault. Beautiful. Mm -mm. 
take a blue lands belt east to Sarmal Spire. Where is Sarmal Spire? Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Up there. Okay. I accept. It'll probably take my volcanic, but I don't care about that very much in exchange for a mana link. However, if I can buy an island on the way, I will. All right. Ah, oh, free dungeon clue. Nice. Thank you, sir. Very, very much appreciated. On we go. Let's see if we can buy an island up in here. All right. Let's buy some islands to decrease the likelihood that we lose our volcanic. All right. And where are we in relation to Siren Moss Spire? Okay, so we got to go down, down a bit and over. Down and over, baby. Ooh, giant strength for a craw worm. Why not? You know what? We've got extra craw worms. We can risk it. We can risk it. Hmm. You know what? Let's go gutsy. Let's go second turn oven riders and watch what happens. Let's see. Let's see if that's a mistake or a great... Whoa! Oh. 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 I may have made, a, I may have made an error. I don't know what I'm going to be facing off against here. All right. Oh, you're going to make gigantic. Oh, kids. Okay. Oh, that can block my Elven Riders. Hmm. Hmm. All right, I guess that changes the plans a little bit. No Elven Riders getting eaten by my own Mana Vault. He's probably playing a deck with a bunch of unholy strengths and, like, unstable mutations and things like that. Ooh. I'm going to... I'm going to lose my Craw Worm. I'm gonna lose my craw worm. Most likely. I guess if he's gonna be wailing with me, uh, wailing on me with the dancing scimitar, I could drop out the elven riders just because I could try and do somewhat of a damage race. I only need one more mana to be able to untap it during my upkeep, so that's not too bad. But I mean, the numbers, they're not, they're not in my favor right now. All right, so let's go to this phase. Oh, wait, I don't have four yet. What was I thinking? Oh, God, it hurts, Mama Jamba. Okay, so let's go Elven Riders, and we'll go the Elves with the Timberwolves attached. All right. Oh, the scimitar is such a problem for me. I don't, I don't want to waste my scroops right yet. Okay. Um, what do we want to do? Hmm. Let's hold back the scrub sprites. Probably a lost cause, anyways, but let's get him as low as I can. I'm gonna block because I'm getting scared now. Okie dokie. Oh, red mana! Finally! Uh, finally! Okay, let's see here. We're at five, though. That's bad times. All right, so we can cast a bolt or a granite gargoyle. The gargoyle will be a chump blocker, so I guess let's swing with these two and see what choices get made. All right, and then we'll drop a gargoyle. And we can just throw that in the way of the dancing scimitar. Oh, no, we can't. That was unexpected. I'm in trouble. Uh, I just died and lost my craw worm. Boo! All right, let's put the craw worm that we just lost back in the deck. No big deal. Okay. Boom. Trade white ammo for any enchantments. No thanks. All right, and we will go. We're on our way to Sarmal Spire. That's right. To get another mana link, baby. Uh, no thanks. Sarmal's bizarre. Oh, that's all the way down there. Okay, I can't walk over there. 
So I won't worry about that yet. Go get a vampire bat. Check out this village here. Oh, you took the volcanic anyways. That's rough. Oh, well. I got my mana link. I now start at 21 life. That's pretty amazing. Alright, and what kind of quest do you have here? Nope. Okay. Let's go and grab this treasure. Saw a monolith, not too shabby. We'll take a quick look at the villages that are nearby to see if there's anything that we want. And then we'll teleport over to try and save that town. Don't want to waste too much time or the town will be taken over. No. We're going to check one more town and we're teleporting over. Oh, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. I want to beat you and I want you to... Actually, you know what? Screw it. I'll just take tribute and food for now. Alright. Uh, white amulet for any sorceries. No thanks. Begin a quest. No thanks. And let's go save the village. Alright, this village is on the line! Oh no, this is a slow rolling start. At least we have both access to both colors. Yikes, I can make a beefcake creature with a giant growth and a bloodlust. Hello! Hello, Elvish Arches! Let's do this, bro! I'm happy to see you. I love Elvish Arches. It's one of my favorite cards. Oh, I see you have your own first striker, you punk. You punk? Fine. You want to trade? You want to trade our first strikers? I thought you might. But now I have a giant spider! Ha ha ha. Ooh, fairy dragon. All right, I can get down with that. Um, let's so screw it. Let's put a fire elemental. Man, this is great. I mean, I'm not punching through yet, but I've got the potential to do a significant amount of damage. Oh, oh, wow, wow, fairy dragon. Every once in a while, you actually do something, and it it's rough. It's rough times. I think that actually, I need to get rid of you. You need to get disintegrated out of existence. All right, let's get you gone, and let's start. Let's start bringing the hurt train over to his station. Here it comes, bit by a spider. How you like me now? You're not taking this village on my watch, pal. Oh, oh. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see how this goes. Oh, yeah. I like that deal. That sugary sweet right there. Yum, yum, yum. You just you just got to eat an entire Krawrum giant spider. That's a massive meal for you. Hope you appreciate what I give you. Hey, stop that. All right. It's up to you, Lanoir. Show them your... Show him your blood rage. Blood rage. Yeah, get him. All right, all we got is an elf and a bolt now. Let's do it. He does have five cards in his hand. I do not like that. I have a feeling big things are about to start coming and pummeling me. Mm -mm -mm. Where's my Shivan? Where are you at, Shivan? You've been so lazy. You never show... Oh, no, a basilisk. That's bad. That's a bad... Oh, this is this is bad. At least my deck has a lot of X burn spells. How many lands do I have here? Oh, I have enough to do oh, a six point burn. Seven with the Lanowar. Alright, screw it. We'll just get beat up by the Thicket Basilisk. And we'll try and kill him with some burn. I don't want to lose this village. I want to protect it. Oh, stop it. Stop it, you goat boy. I'm going to bolt you and hope for a big burn spell right now. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, burn spell. I'm praying to the top deck gods now, boys. Top deck, save me. Top deck, save me. Oh, please stop. Please stop. Oh, no. 
Oh no. Little one ones. Give me that burn spell. Oh give me that burn spell. Ugh. Oh, well at least maybe I can swing through for a point of damage unless he puts out another fat body. Yay, he didn't. Oh god, make it stop. Is it even worth you know what it's I'm i I'm praying for a burn spell. Save him for blocking. Save him for blocking. Save it him for blocking. Give me a fat burn spell. I don't care about your regenerating elf, okay? I don't care. Uh, oh, God. Um, it's seven just like him. Come on. Come on. Oh, no, boys. Oh, no, boys. This one's... This one's... Uh, we'll see how it goes. No! Oh no, he's stream of life. How am I supposed to survive? I can't. I'm boned. I'm be owned, yo. I just got be owned. I don't think that I can win this one anymore. I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna hold on and try. I'm all ho oh, Damn it, there's no way. Okay. Maybe the computer's really, really stupid and won't attack. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I'm dead. Oh, man! I lost a mana tap, dude. I just lost a life point. Rough. Rough. Oh, I hate you. I hate you. And look at you with your weird... What is that? All right. Oh. It hurts, boy. Oh, it hurts. It hurts my soul. Defeat a sedge beast for two red... White? Did you say white? Oh. All right, I'm going to try. Come here, Sage Beast. Let's do it. Let's do it, you land destruction punk. Man, that was such a brutal just beat down. Like, I'm taking this village. There's nothing you can do about it. Mom, no, I'm sorry. All right, Elvish Archers, it's up to you. We gotta get in there against this land destruction goober. All right, what do we wanna do? Um, let's go Granite Gargoyle. He's gonna smoke my lands. Oh, another one, huh? Another one, huh, buddy? There we go, that's nice. Got me a timber wolf. Alright, let's just get in there. Just want to give him the opportunity to build up his forces too much before he starts wiping on my lands, because I know it's coming. I saw that sinkhole, pal. You ain't fooling nobody, Stone Rain Boy. You ain't fooling nobody, pal. Iron clot works. They're not that big a problem. They can only block stuff that can't kill them because they're cowards. Get in there, boy. All right. Where do we go? And we'll give you a giant growth. Yeah, looking pretty good. He's at one. I like these odds. A thin troll. All right, well. You ain't got a flyer. Or enough blockers, so you done, son. Alright. Oh, red on Metal Blast. I'll take it for that. Okay, let's go... Get our white mana stones. White amulets, I should say. Fantastic. And two extra bonus life in my next duel. So good. 
All right, so we're down in this area. Let's let's see what the villages around here are like. Alright, nothing I want. Go to south? Well, geez, I mean, we're right there, right? Windless Glade is down there. That's a done deal. What do I need to take? Just the message for a mana link? Oh, yeah, we're about to get that mana link we just got taken away back, boys. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, gotta go further. Must go out further. Ooh, Bograith would be great if I was playing black. Okay. Boom. Sweet. Oh, look at that. Sender Vampire again would be fantastic if I was playing black. Blue amulets for color cards. What uncommon artifacts are there? Oh, oh that's common. Uncommon. Uh, oh. Oh, yeah. Let's be a cheese boy. I'm gonna be a cheese boy. Hello, Black Vice. Alright, you know what? Let's see. Let's let's trim this down a bit. Let's get rid of the bloodlust, because I don't really care that much about that many creature boosts. Let us also trim out a do 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 giant spiders aren't terribly exciting. Get rid of you and you, and we'll leave it at that for now. All right, what kind of quest you got? Defeat a merfolk shaman? Hmm. 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 I want to fight you. <clears throat> I want to fight you, mind stealer. I saw you lurking out here. Oh. Might, might not have got the best hand to start out with here. Give me a green. There we go. All right. Awesome. Probably should have cast my elvish archers there, but I wanted another source of green. Nice, this is an aggressive little start. Not too shabby. Say it's shaping up pretty good, boys. Oh, hip not oh your mana screwed. Yeah. Drop all the hordes. Let's get in there. Too bad overrun wasn't made for like by the time they made this game overrun wasn't a thing. But hey, I just got a black vice. For those of you who don't know, that card is busted stupid wrong. Like, unfair. Alright, let's go get us some beatings. Wow. Wow, this is over so fast. Alright, finish them off, boys. Nicely done. Ooh, a tropical island. Oh, a duplicate card of my choice! Yes! I can get an extra copy of any card I own. Well, now, if we're gonna be a cheese boy, let's be a cheese boy. Let's be a real cheese boy. Let's get cheesy. <laughs> Alright, I'm dropping the vice. And what are we going to cut? We're going to, you know what, you uh, tend to be too unwieldy. We're getting a little tighter with our deck. So we'll get rid of, yeah, screw it. You know, we'll get rid of two of them. Why not? Go down to 60. All right. Cold Snap Tavern, you say? Where's Cold Snap Tavern? Uh, I don't see it anywhere around here. All right. Fair enough. Oh, you want some? All right. I'll do you. I'll do you, bro. Why don't I try this deck? What? What? Okay. What am I playing? What? I'm playing a white deck. Okay. Huh. I forgot that this was a thing. Alright. Well, I guess we're just going to have to play it as we get it. What do we even have? What's this? Pro Black 1-5 walls and stuff? Alright. We got some weirdness going down. Oh, yeah. Fire breathing Mesa Pegasus, son. I got a blessed Mesa Pegasus. It's not too bad. Let's get some. All 
Yeah, I'm gonna pump this mess of Pegasus right up. Oh no! Oh no! A Tim. A Tim. It means I'm gonna have to keep mana open to use my blessing to save my mess of Pegasus. Hopefully he'll be... St yeah, I'm not gonna use the damage... Oh god, well as long as I have this healing solve in my hand. Every time anything takes damage. Alright, pump, pump with the blessing. There you go, buddy. You wasted your damage. Hope that was worth it. Oh, I can't believe I'm stuck with this deck. Oh, come on. Oh, mama, no. Oh, this is some bologna sauce. This is some heavy level bologna sauce. Oh, good. Yeah, good. Draw more cards. This is... Man, I'm going to lose something from my main deck because I have to play this pile of trash. That's so annoying. Yeah, I'm not casting my wall of lights and letting my Pegasus die. Alright, let's just try and kill him because this is just going to be annoying otherwise. I mean, at this rate, if nothing changes, I can win at least. But this is terrible. This is a terrible hand. Oh, God. Oh, this is going to be the game that goes on for infinity. At least I can put it a cat. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Now I'm going to have to keep attacking with the mess because it's to entice him to use a prodigal sorcerer. He'll start hitting me with it. Oh, this truly is a nightmarish game. I hate when they give you these decks. I hope there's something good in here. I really do. Oh, go! Go suck on an egg, buddy. Go suck that egg hard. Are you... Are you... Why did I do that? Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Why did I do that? Oh, you're... The weird, confusing thing the computer did just made me do a weird, confusing, dumb thing. Stop getting in my head, computer. Oh, he's metagaming me. Stop it. He's put me on tilt. Stop tilting me. Oh, he got my mess of Pegasus. He tilted me. He tilted me. I suck. I suck. He disoriented me with this deck. I don't even know. Now I got no hope. No hope. Zone. All right, well, whatever, man. We'll put on a wall of light. Gain some life. Good luck killing that wall, chunder punk. Two can play at this annoying extended game of wallness. Oh, God. I don't even know what's in my deck, so I don't even know if I should be like Wilson Phillips and hold on for one more day or not. But I'm going to. Game that life. Alright, game, thanks. Thanks for robbing me of one life point, too. Thank you. Ugh. The slow grind of the prodigal tapping. Please, mama, no. This is going to end up being the longest episode of the Chandelier Sessions because of this stupid white deck. Literally, I was like, okay, I know after this game it's going to be about time to wrap this episode up. And this is going to, oh, man, just lordy, lordy. I mean, I'll forfeit when I know I'm beat for sure. Oh, there's disenchants in the deck. Okay. All right. Um, I guess we'll get rid of the Rod of Ruin. See, I don't even know what I'm playing with, so I've just got to sit here. I'm not a Twitter, though, and I don't want to lose, like, whatever I have up as ante either. Yeah, good. Draw more cards. This game favors him so hard. It favors him so hard right now, especially since I don't even know it's in here. Yeah, good. Cast more walls that I can't get through. A reverse damage! He only does one point at a time! What? No! Oh, man. Alright, if I put it, I can put out a mess of Pegasus and put a blessing on it and watch him just be an idiot trying to kill it, maybe. 
Oh, never mind. Alright. Let's put out a blessing mess of Pegasus. And actually, we might have enough planes to just try and punch through. It's probably going to control magic in now or something obnoxious. What do I have? I have six planes, so I can pump this thing up to a seven, nine. Yikes. The extra card draw. This is so, so sad. I'm a sad panda right now. Stop it. Animate wall. Oh, great. I can attack with my one, seven walls. Oh, God. I hope there are better walls in here, like walls of swords or something. All right. Um, okay. He can only do one point a turn, so he can't kill the... You can kill the Pegasus when it's tapped if I don't keep one mana open. So let's attack with the Pegasus and we'll see what happens. Alright, you can do a point to me, fine. Block with the wall. Alright, so we will give this a four point boost then. And we will eat one of your walls. Yum, yum, yum. Alright. We've got a path. We're going to walk it. We're going to try and win this one. He's got card advantage on me, which is really significant, and the fact that I'm playing an unknown deck is not helping. I'm just going to have to play it as I go. I can't plan much ahead. Stupid nonsense like reverse damage. Although I guess it's good to remember that she has this for when I play against this, because this is like the White Cleric Chicks deck that they gave me. Alright. Uh-huh. Fortified area. Hey, alright. You know what? That beefs up the walls a bit. That's something. Oh, God. He's got an old man at this. No, it's not an old man. See, it's a pirate ship. Oh, wow. This is... This is brutal. Brutal, boys. Uh, absolutely brutal. Force me to play with this deck and then just give me the saddest time of my life with it. And the fact that I have the Ivory Cups and don't want to just give up, like... That's what makes it harder, because it's given, it's like the game's given me the tools to put me in a soul-grinding, what? You Okay, you're activating against your own, now you really are just teasing me, I hate you. Oh, a rocket launcher. Well, no, even that, reverse damage. Psyblast. How does reverse damage work? So far to me, oh man, get out of here. Alright, so the Pegasus has taken four damage. I guess I will healing solve it. Bam! Get wrecked. Another planes. Alright. Come on, Pegasus. We gotta get in there. Don't block. Don't block. Oh, okay. Fine, block. Alright, so we got four, so we got a five, five, Pegasi. Boom. Alright. We've got a path in the air now. We might actually end up winning this one. We just gotta keep the mess of Pegasus alive, which with the rocket launcher is definitely not guaranteed. Oh, Aladdin's ring. Okay, that's kind of scary. But at the same time. At the same time, if it stops him from being able to do anything about the flyer, I can swing him with the Mesa Pegasus for a kill right now. I might actually pull this off. I can't even believe it. I might I might actually pull this off. Alright, let's go for it. Does he have Does he have a trick? Or did I not Yeah! Mmm! Sweet! So sweet! And a duplicate card? What? You know what? We need more ivory towers. Let's get another ivory tower. Thank you, sir. Alright, let's get back to the town. Alright, well we can safely say, my friends, this is the end of a crazy 8th installment of the Sandalot... Sandlot of the Chandelar Sessions. Thanks for coming and rocking with me the long way today because this was a longer episode. And I will see you guys next time. Elver of Secrets. Do you want to know what the secret of MTG Purple is? Come closer. Together, we are the sixth color of magic.
All right, how crazy was that? They just shoved a white deck into my hands and were like, here you play it. But I persevered like a boss for this extra long episode of the Chandelar Session. So, roll the Golden Lord Scroll! Oh, yeah! Check out those delicious, lovely names scrolling on by. Ooh, ooh, so beautiful, so dope, so clean. Oh, yeah, and what's the time for now? Now it's time for... What's it going to be? You're going to watch some more Chandelar? I got the playlist right here. Or you're going to go on over for some lore action over here. Oh, oh, dealer's choice. Oh, do it. Do it. And I'm history, baby.